Eye in focus. Cool. Love to see it. Hey y'all, I'm Evan, and this is a dorm tour of the Green Wave Hall, which is just another name for the Hyatt Place Hotel that Tulane decided to buy. Let's vibe. This is my college dorm at Tulane, and here it is. It's a single, but it has a king-size bed uh, and a couch with another fold-out bed, so if somebody wanted to sleep over, they could. Uh, I also have a fun uh, bit of reading material for my uh, guests if they ever stay over. Something to lighten the mood while they wait. There's a TV, which is quite nice. And of course, I set up a router because the Wi-Fi here is awful, so I had to make my own. It was really actually quite simple. I just called the tech support line and told them I was trying to set up a printer. I uh, gave them the MAC address and they just set it up so that it didn't have to follow any of the regular rules of the Wi-Fi. There's a nice chair. It's a knockoff Herman Miller, but it's still fine. It has a pneumatic lift, and the leather is quite comfortable. There's a 43-inch TV, and you can use it to watch anything, including HBO. There's some fine decor on the walls already. There's a number of different pictures and paintings. Although they don't quite fit my tastes, I can't change them, so I've got to get used to them. Of course, I brought my own art as well. Um, I go for a tasteful uh, and experimental. On my bedside table, I keep everything you might need, including a mask, a wallet, a phone dock, and a couple chargers. At my desk, I have everything as well, including a stapler and anything else you might need to do any kind of arts and crafts, except for any kind of glue, because glue, glue sucks. I also brought a full color printer and some staples and a stapler to set next to it, so you don't have to go over to the actual desk, which is you know, a full four feet away in order to do some stapling. There are only three drawers in the whole place, so I went ahead and I put my clothes in them. There's another compartment for a mini fridge or freezer, but I'm just using it to store water because the campus meal plan covers a lot. There's a shuttle that takes you back and forth every half hour from campus, or to this hall, Green Wave Hall, although the shuttle can be unpredictable. On the weekends, the earliest you can get a shuttle is one, but like Uber or Lyft, it's on demand and you can request it with an app called TapRide, which makes it honestly pretty great. Before one o'clock though, there's no effective or quick way to get to campus other than riding the train, which is only about three blocks from the hotel, but still, it's hot, it's New Orleans, it's an on-air conditioned train, so it kind of stinks. On my first day here, I wrote a quick note to everyone on the floor asking them to add my Snapchat, and I made a group chat for the whole floor so we can communicate and make sure that we're all getting to the right place at the right time. It was wonderful when I received a few notes back. The bathroom is just your average hotel bathroom. You have a shower, a sink, a place to store, medicine, toothbrush, that kind of thing, a toilet, and a really, actually just beautiful, amazing, luxurious waste paper basket. It's, it's really something to behold. Never seen anything like it, it's just beautiful. I've never seen a room tour before, but I can imagine it's just some chill guy chatting, and showing you some videos of his dorm and pajamas. So that's what I'm doing. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you learned something. Maybe you'll consider Green Wave Hall at the Hyatt Place in New Orleans um, during this pandemic. Thanks. Bold and brash. Woman. Yeah.